Hey, what's up everyone? It's Giorgio, your friendly neighborhood YouTuber, and I'm here to play some good old Cuphead. And um, I know it's been a minute, and I promised that I would, uh, you know, have this game on the channel and everything, but, you know, stuff came up, you know. <laughs> but uh, I hope everyone is doing really well, and um, you will enjoy this awesome footage. And so yeah, once upon a time in a magical place called Inkwell Isle, there were two brothers named Cuphead and Mugman, of course. And then one day, the two boys wander from home, and despite the elderly uh, Elder Kettle's many warnings, ended up in the wrong side of the tracks and entered the Devil's Casino. Ooh, that sounds very spooky, don't it? And of course, these dumbasses decided they want to go and gamble with some evil creatures and talking dice and skeletons and everything like that <laughs> and then of course you know they were doing really well you know they were they didn't think they could lose but then of course the devil he wanted to take pride in you know uh you know in their gambling habits mainly cuphead the person that in the red you know the cuphead character that's in the red mugman is the guy in blue and so the devil promised them in one more roll, if they win, all the loot in his casino will be theirs, you know. And then, but if he said if they lose, he will have their souls. And of course, Cuphead, blinded by easy riches, nodded and grabbed the dice for a throw. And good gosh, Cuphead, no, <laughs> cried Mugman, for he understood the danger. But it was too late. Cuphead dumbass decided to bet every day on, the, on this casino in order to get all the riches. And of course, these people knew that he was going to lose. Even the devil did. But Snake Eyes laughed the devil while slamming the floor. You lose. The brothers trembled because they knew what was about to happen. And of course, the brothers pleaded for their very lives. There, there must be another way to repay you, Mugman stumbled. And of course, you know, the devil snuck, snickered and said, he pulled out a parchment. He said, I have a list of runaway debtors, <laughs> debtors, collect their souls for me, and I might just pardon you m two mugs. I don't know, man. I don't know if he's going to do that, because you make it a deal with the devil. You can't trust him. And, you know, it's, just, it's very funny about this, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> And of course, he kicked them out of their casino. All the milk and whatever it is just came out of their head. <laughs> and then Cuphead and Mugman ran terribly frightened and ran away as fast as they could. Come on, Mug. Painted Cuphead. We have to go and come up with a plan. Basically. <laughs> and here, we're in this, um, we're in the house, I guess. Uh, I don't know who that character is, but, um, he says, What a fine pickle you boys have gotten yourself into. I know you don't want to be pawns of the devil, but if you refuse, I can't bear to imagine what might happen. And you must play along. You know. <laughs> I know, I, you guys can pause this if you want to read the dialogue, you know. Um, because I was trying to hurry up and get this footage together, but stuff kept coming up. You know, on my end. It says, take this potion so that you won't be hung out to dry. I guess that potion gave um, Mugnan and Cuphead their powers. Now go to my writing desk and use the magical ink well. You need to prepare yourselves for a scrap. That's true. And there's a tutorial right here. So, yeah. This is going to be very interesting. And of course, they just basically showing you how to operate the game. And this is basically a 2D run and gun type of game. And as you can see, um, this is the Xbox um, One version. This game is also on the Nintendo Switch. And I assume that it is probably $20. But uh, the controls are very easy to learn. I guarantee you guys, I've died so many times while putting this footage together. At least 20, 30 times, probably. You know. But uh, it's so much fun. Like, even if you die um, on here like 50 times, you still want to go back and play it again. And they even got the little parry snap slap 
move, whatever that is. And of course, I had a lot of difficulty trying to jump across here. It's really weird. But yeah, I think I eventually caught on, you know, and I was getting myself across there. Um, and um, what I had to do to prepare this footage is I had to um, use the Mixer app and I had to do a live stream so I could save the footage from my Xbox without having to use a capture card. And uh, so that saves you kind of, that saves you a lot of money there. And then though, you can use those coins to purchase cool items and stuff from the shops. You know, so now we're ready to go and lay out all those debtors and get those contract signed. And uh, I tell you guys, the boss fights in this game are so fun. Um, s since they take so long to like do, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to include at least one boss fight per video. Um, and I'm gonna try to at least do one one or two cuphead videos per week you know and it says hey fellas uh whatever dang it i kept i kept pressing the a button way too fast but look at the characters they look so cool don't they you know and there's the shop over there you can upgrade your weapons and stuff like that and you can use the gold coins that you earn from i guess you know playing through some of the levels but look how difficult, look at the, the characters, like the animations. Like right here, I'm shooting a, a potato. You know, this is a, quite fun. He's spitting uh, mud balls and worms at me. <laughs> like, golly, that must be a very bad contaminated potato to be shooting mud and worm balls at me. <laughs> but, um, wow, it's just something else. And you gotta be careful, you know, your timing has to be on point, for real. Oh, look at that, that's a cabbage. Oh, he looks like he's about to cry. <laughs> oh my god. And you gotta be so careful, like, even though, if you get hit by one of them raindrops, if you get hit one time, you would lose your HP. The game starts you off with 3 HP. So, one hit, you can lose your HP. And you see those cards over there? Um, you can use them to use uh, your super attack, you know? And see, and you, have, you also have different guns for your character. Like, I had switched over to this green leaf looking uh, gun that Mugman is using right here. And it's actually pretty good for um, killing off multiple things, like multiple projectiles from your enemy. And so, really, um, the, I, the way that I've discovered to win these boss battles right here, or evil characters that you're facing, is you have to learn their pattern, which that may take you losing a couple of times, you know. So, you may have to lose a few times, but once you learn the patterns, they're really easy, you, you know, it becomes easier to uh, defeat them. And this is, is so, it, when you're fighting little things like this, you want to use that green, um, the green missiles or whatever he's shooting out. And there you have it. I killed it. Wow. So that was pretty cool, wasn't it? I mean, I thought that was pretty little awesome footage right there, if I say so myself. <laughs> but yeah, this is kind of just a little tutorial of, uh, how the game works. I will be doing some other stuff from this, and um, let me know what you all think of this in the uh, comment section below, and I hope you all have a very awesome, blissful day.